In 1986, the Cleveland Balloon Festival took place in Ohio. They tried to set a world record by releasing almost 1.5 million balloons. This fest was put by the United Way of Cleveland, a charity organization. They wanted to do it for publicity and fundraising. The stunt was coordinated by Balloon Art by Treb, a Los Angeles-based company headed by Treb Heining, which spent six months preparing for it. A rectangular structure the size of a city block was set up to hold the balloons, on the southwest quadrant of Public Square in Cleveland. Inside the structure, 2,500 students and other volunteers spent many hours filling the balloons with helium. United Way originally planned to release 2 million balloons, but eventually stopped at over 1.4 million due to bad weather. On Saturday, September 27, 1986, organizers released the balloon at about 1.50 p.m. 1.5 million balloons rose up from Cleveland's public square, surrounding Terminal Tower, moving towards sky. That was one of the most beautiful and rare scenes of all time. Everyone was enjoying the scene without thinking about consequences. Organizers believed that the balloons would eventually run out of helium and fall back to Earth where they would biodegrade. The event was intended to be harmless, but the balloons drifted back over the city and landed in the surrounding areas which caused a lot of accidents. The balloons even made their way to Burke Lake Airport which causes the airport to shut down the entire runway. It also caused a lot of injuries. The organizers and the city faced lawsuits seeking millions of dollars in damages, and cost overruns put the event at a net loss. After that, no one ever dares to perform a stunt like that. In 1988 the Guinness Book of World Records recognizes the event as a world record largest ever mass balloon release. If you like this video then don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos and leave the future video suggestion in the comment section.